What's up guys, David here and welcome to another episode of Getting to Know Your Dog's Breed with Athenis Pets. Today we are going to be talking about one of the largest dog breeds, the Great Dane. Lots of people are intimidated by the Great Dane's big size, but they really are just gentle giants. In fact, this guy looks scared himself. How about we look at the Great Dane's history? The Great Dane originated in Germany. It is believed that they came about in the 1600s. They were originally bred to hunt large mammals. These mammals included large deer, boars, and many others. This past doesn't seem to carry over to the modern day Great Dane though. Now they tend to be peaceful and friendly dogs. This doesn't mean you don't have to train them though. As with any dog, poor training can lead to unwanted behaviors. With the Great Dane's massive size, this could be a worry. Now we turn it over to the Athenis Pets pros and cons list. As you can see here, the major pros for the Great Dane are their easy going friendly personalities and a willingness to be trained. One of the major cons is that they are too big for apartment living. Also, as with any dog, they require a lot of time and effort. I like to think of this as a good thing, but I understand some people just can't spend their whole day with their dogs. One thing to remember is every dog is different. While these are typically Great Dane characteristics, getting to know your own pooch is very important. Now let's take a look at the Great Dane's colors. The Great Dane pictured here is black with a small white patch on its chest. Most Great Danes are either black or a brownish color called a brindle. However, some Great Danes can be blue. As we shift over to Great Dane physical characteristics, we find this to be one of the most interesting dog breeds for this category. Their height is almost three feet when standing on all fours. This might not seem like a lot, but when they get up on their hind legs, they are taller than most adults. To analyze their weight, we look at the Athenas Pets Breed Weight Index. Here we see lots of dogs, ranging from three to six pounds to up to 150 plus pounds. As you can imagine, the Great Dane is near the top of this list. So what does the Great Dane actually weigh? They come in at 100 to 200 pounds. Hey, that's 40 pounds heavier than me. Some interesting facts about the Great Dane include that the breed holds the record for tallest dog at almost four feet. Also, one of the most famous cartoon characters of all time, Scooby Dooby Doo, was based off of the Great Dane. If you want to learn more about different dog breeds or great dog training content, make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell. Like I said earlier, every dog is different and we want to hear about your dogs. Please tell us about your dogs in the comment section below and let us know what breed we should make a video on next. Thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like on the video and make sure to take a visit to our site, athenaspets.com. Again, thanks for watching. Cheers.